Harris is Frankie Harris with the Boy Strength Ministries broadcast. Welcome. It's good to be with you today. We invite you to write us, uh, call us, message us. We would like to give you an answer to your biblical uh, question or a question about your life or what God expects or requires or wishes that you and I would do. Uh, I have been asked a question. Uh, Brother Harris, uh, can you interpret tongues? And of course you can. In the Bible, in 1 Corinthians chapter 14, the Apostle Paul deals with this subject. You see, there's a lot of confusion in Christendom about speaking in tongues. And I'm amazed that the people that try to come out in public and answer the question about speaking in tongues and interpretation of tongues and messages in tongues, these people have never spoken in tongues. You know, don't make yourself look foolish. The Apostle Paul clearly states that the gift of tongues uh, is an operation of the Spirit. Now, speaking in tongues is a sign that a person has been baptized with the Holy Ghost. But a message given in tongues and interpreted is an operation of the Holy Spirit through any Spirit-filled believer. Yes, it's true. In a church service, the Bible teaches in 1 Corinthians that a, a believer can give out a message in tongues, the Holy Spirit can move through that person, and then the same Holy Spirit that gives out the message in tongues can move through another Spirit-filled believer, and that believer can interpret that unknown tongue. And the Bible says the confirmation of this is by two or more witnesses. So yes, the answer to this question is, it is real given a message out in tongues, and the gift interpreted is very real. It's been happening now in the church for over 2,000 years and continues to this day. May God richly bless you, and thank you for joining us.